Hi guys. Today I'm going to tell you about the strangest experience I've had while traveling. Now, I have a very good friend from Japan. I met him during college, and his name is Wataru. And he invited me to go home to Japan with him um, the summer after my sophomore year of college. So after my second year of college, I went to Tokyo with him for one week. This is Wataru and I out to eat with his friends. Uh, Wataru is sitting next to me on the far right hand side closest to the camera. And yes, we are all sitting on the floor. It was very cool. Now, my favorite part of Japan was definitely the food. The food was so good. It was really healthy. They cook with a lot of vegetables and a lot of broths and a lot of rice and wheat noodles. Um, so it was really healthy and all of it tasted amazing. Um, it was just, it was a wonderful experience as far as food goes. This is called doria. And it's an Italian food that they make in Japan that was super yummy. And this other meal is something I ate on the train. It was a lot of vegetables and rice, and it was really good too. I have a rule for myself when I travel. And that is that I have to try every kind of food that I'm offered at least one time. So if I don't like it, I won't eat it again. But I have to at least try it one time. So we went to a really nice restaurant with Wataru's cousin. And his cousin paid for the meal and he ordered some dishes for everybody to share. Now, I didn't ask what anything was, because it all looked very good. This is a picture of Wataru and I eating dinner with his cousin and a friend. His cousin is at the back of the photo wearing the green shirt, and on the table are the menus that he ordered from. I even ate the raw meat without asking questions. So in Japan, at some of the nice restaurants, they serve their meat without cooking it. They prepare it in a special way that, so that it doesn't need to be cooked. And it's actually really good. So at the end of this meal, Wataru's cousin looked at me and said, So have you ever eaten horse before? And my reply was, Oh no, I would never eat horse. And the whole table got completely silent. And I just started looking around. And finally, I looked at Wataru and I said, I just ate horse, didn't I? And he said, yes. And the whole table was laughing. So I asked him, what, which meat was the horse? And he said it was the small, dark red meat that was raw. And I said, are you serious? That was my favorite meat. <laughs> so that was my strangest experience, um, was finding out that I had eaten horse and also realizing that I really enjoyed it. Now... I don't think that I could ever eat horse again, because if I knew I was eating horse, I would feel bad, I guess, because I like horses. They're, they're beautiful, and they're elegant, and they're just, in my mind, they're not something that you eat, um, but I really did enjoy that experience in Japan, and I was glad that they didn't tell me what it was before I tried it, because I don't know that I would have been brave enough to actually put it in my mouth. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, leave, me, leave them on the blog, and I'll respond to you. Thanks!